Sawadeekhap. I'm JP Mistanza. Welcome to Phuket Extra, brought to you by pvcphuket.com. During yesterday's rehearsal of accepting tourists at the Phuket International Airport, Governor Narong Munchero was there and he told reporters that Phuket has already seen four French tourists come through the island, quarantine for 14 days, and go on their way to Cambodia without any problems. The four arrivals landed by jet and were allowed to land in Phuket as the COVID-19 Situation Administration in Bangkok, the CCSA, they've designated them as a trial group as a way to test the system, and this happened over two weeks ago. The governor said, quote, Opening the door wide to accepting foreigners coming in without testing the system is impossible. We followed all the CCSA procedures strictly every step of the way. Phuket is getting sick now and the revenue generated from the tourism industry, about 400 billion baht a year, has all disappeared. Meanwhile, Anthony Lark, president of the Phuket Hotels Association, said it may take months for the government to bring forth a plan which still needs a wider local support and inter-ministerial coordination. Attempts to stimulate local demand cannot prevent the dramatic loss of jobs and rapidly deteriorating financial crisis for owners and operators, as hotels are reported to have single-digit occupancy rates. Hotels in Phuket are unable to sustain their business by depending on domestic consumption. Some 86,000 registered rooms on the island cannot break even or maintain positive cash flow, resulting in 50,000 job losses if international tourists are not allowed, according to him. Meanwhile, two more hotels have been officially approved in Phuket to serve as alternative state quarantine facilities, including Phuket Graceland Resort and, including Phuket Graceland Resort and Spa in Patong, and Meta di Phuket in Kata, joining Trisara Phuket Villas and Anantara Maikau Phuket for whenever tours are allowed to land in Phuket. Still, about 70 hotel applications have been accepted, 60 have been approved in Phuket, but waiting for approval from Bangkok officials. But if approved, Phuket would have about 5,000 rooms altogether for quarantine. For more, visit thephuketnews.com. With anti-government protests continuing, calling for a new constitution among other demands, the prime minister, who has been touting constitutional amendments instead of a new charter, he warned that it could cost up to 10 billion baht to set up referendums. Speaking with reporters yesterday, Prime Minister Prayu chan -cha said each referendum on the amendments to change the constitution would cost about 4 to 5 billion baht each, including spending on COVID-19 prevention measures, which says that only 600 voters are allowed at each voting station. The election commission says that at least two national referendums will be required, one on the amendment of the charter change process to set up a charter drafting body, and then another on the new charter itself. The charter amendment process was set in motion after students launched a series of anti-government protests beginning in July. One of their demands was to rewrite the constitution. For more, visit thephuketnews.com. And the total number of coronavirus cases has reached 3,447 in Thailand after one confirmed infection today, a Japanese film producer who was already in quarantine in Bangkok. So far, 96% of patients have recovered, while the death toll is unchanged at 58. It's a short and sweet one today. Thank you for watching Phuket Extra, brought to you by pvcphuket.com. For safe, secure, and soundproof windows, visit pvcphuket.com. We'll be back tomorrow. Until then, stay classy, Phuket. Phuket's rapid modernization has made it one of the world's premier holiday destinations. Investors can still buy quality condominiums for as low as 75,000 US dollars, and luxury properties can go all the way up to 20 million. Condominiums in Phuket are a safe, secure bricks and mortar investment, offering foreigners freehold ownership. Call or email Thai Residential. Phuket's number one trusted real estate advisor to find your perfect Phuket property.